The Earth is warming, this is a fact. Our climate is changing and human activities, particularly our reliance on fossil fuels, are largely to blame. But what if I told you there's a way to pull carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere and store it safely in the ground? This is the promise of carbon farming. Carbon farming captures atmospheric carbon dioxide and sequesters it in the soil. By changing the way we farm, we can transform our fields into vast carbon sinks. Practices like no-till farming, cover cropping, and crop rotation increase soil organic matter. We often think of agriculture as a benign and essential human activity, and indeed it is. But conventional farming practices have inadvertently turned our fields into significant sources of greenhouse gases. Tilling the soil, for example, releases carbon dioxide that has been locked away for centuries. The use of synthetic fertilizers, while boosting yields in the short term, also contributes to the release of nitrous oxide, a potent greenhouse gas. Livestock production, particularly of cattle, is another major source of methane, a gas with an even greater warming potential than carbon dioxide. The problem is not farming itself, but rather the industrial model of agriculture that has come to dominate our food system. This model prioritizes short-term profits over long-term sustainability, often at the expense of soil health and the environment. The good news is that we have the knowledge and the tools to change course. By transitioning to carbon farming practices, we can significantly reduce agriculture's environmental impact and even turn it into a net carbon sink. Plants absorb carbon dioxide during photosynthesis and convert it into organic matter. Some carbon is released back into the atmosphere while a portion remains sequestered in the soil. Conventional farming disrupts this cycle, leading to a net release of greenhouse gases. Carbon farming enhances the soil's ability to store carbon long-term. No-till farming minimizes soil disturbance, reducing carbon dioxide release. Cover cropping adds organic matter, enhancing carbon sequestration. Crop rotation improves soil health and fertility. Agroforestry sequesters carbon and provides additional benefits like shade and habitat for wildlife. Together, these practices create a virtuous cycle leading to healthier soil and plants. The benefits of carbon farming extend far beyond carbon sequestration. By improving soil health, these practices also lead to a cascade of positive outcomes for farmers and the environment. Healthy soil is the foundation of a productive and resilient agricultural system. Carbon-rich soil is more fertile, meaning it can hold more nutrients and water, reducing the need for synthetic fertilizers and irrigation. This translates into lower input costs for farmers and reduced pollution of waterways. Improved soil structure also leads to better drainage and aeration, creating a more favorable environment for plant roots. This results in healthier plants that are more resistant to pests, diseases, and extreme weather events. In addition to these agronomic benefits, carbon farming also provides a range of ecosystem services. By increasing soil organic matter, we can improve water infiltration and retention, reducing runoff and erosion. This is particularly important in the face of climate change, which is expected to bring more frequent and severe droughts and floods. Section 5 Waterwise Carbon Farming's Impact on Water Conservation Water is a precious resource and agriculture is a major consumer. Climate change increases droughts making water conservation crucial. Carbon farming improves water use efficiency. More organic matter helps soil absorb and retain water. This reduces water loss to runoff and evaporation. No-till farming preserves soil structure aiding water infiltration. Cover crops improve water infiltration and reduce evaporation. Efficient water use eases pressure on freshwater resources, ensuring long-term sustainability for agriculture and farmers. Section 6 Beyond the Farm, Carbon Credits and Economic Incentives While the environmental benefits of carbon farming are clear, transitioning to these practices can require upfront investments and changes in management. To encourage wider adoption, it's crucial to create economic incentives for farmers who sequester carbon in their soils. This is where carbon markets come in. Carbon markets allow companies and individuals to offset their own greenhouse gas emissions by purchasing carbon credits from farmers and landowners who are sequestering carbon in their soils. By putting a price on carbon, these markets create a financial incentive for farmers to adopt carbon farming practices. The revenue generated from carbon credits can help to offset the costs of transitioning to these practices, 
and provide an additional source of income for farmers. Governments can also play a role in supporting carbon farming through policies such as subsidies, tax breaks, and technical assistance programs. By creating a supportive policy environment, we can accelerate the adoption of carbon farming and unlock its full potential to mitigate climate change. Section 7, Scaling Up Sustainability, The Challenges of Widespread Adoption Scaling up carbon farming to meet climate challenges is not without hurdles. Farmers face tight margins and unpredictable weather, making them cautious about new practices. Lack of awareness and understanding of carbon farming is a primary challenge. Many are unfamiliar with carbon sequestration science and practices. Access to technical assistance and resources is limited. Initial costs for adopting carbon farming can be a barrier. Section 8. Technology to the Rescue Precision in Carbon Farming Fortunately, advancements in agricultural technology offer promising solutions to many of the challenges hindering the widespread adoption of carbon farming. Precision agriculture, with its arsenal of sensors, data analytics, and automated systems, can empower farmers to implement carbon farming practices with greater accuracy and efficiency. Imagine drones equipped with multispectral cameras soaring over vast fields, collecting data on soil health, plant vigor, and carbon sequestration rates. This data, processed through sophisticated algorithms, can provide farmers with real-time insights into their fields, enabling them to make informed decisions about when and where to adjust their practices to maximize carbon sequestration. Precision planning equipment can ensure that cover crops are sown at the optimal depth and spacing, maximizing their growth and carbon sequestration potential. Variable rate technology allows farmers to apply fertilizers and other inputs with pinpoint accuracy, reducing waste and minimizing environmental impact. Section 9. Data-Driven Decisions – Monitoring and Optimizing Carbon Sequestration One of the most significant challenges in carbon farming is accurately measuring and verifying the amount of carbon being sequestered in the soil. Traditional soil sampling methods are time-consuming, labor-intensive, and provide only a snapshot in time. Emerging technologies, however, are revolutionizing the way we monitor and quantify soil carbon. Remote sensing technologies such as satellite imagery and LIDAR can provide high-resolution maps of soil carbon stocks over large areas. These technologies are being combined with machine learning algorithms to develop predictive models that can estimate soil carbon sequestration rates based on a range of factors including soil type, land management practices, and climate data. The ability to accurately measure and verify carbon sequestration is crucial for the development of robust carbon markets. By providing farmers with the tools to track their progress and demonstrate the environmental benefits of their practices, we can create a more transparent and accountable system for rewarding farmers for their contributions to climate change mitigation. Section 10. A Global Imperative Carbon Farming for a Sustainable Future Climate change is a global challenge that requires a global response. Carbon farming has the potential to play a significant role in mitigating climate change while also improving the livelihoods of farmers and enhancing the resilience of our food systems. From the vast plains of the American Midwest to the rice paddies of Southeast Asia, farmers around the world are already embracing carbon farming practices. By sharing knowledge and best practices, we can accelerate the adoption of these practices and unlock their full potential to sequester carbon, improve soil health, and enhance food security. Governments, research institutions, and the private sector all have a role to play in supporting the transition to carbon farming. By investing in research and development, providing technical assistance to farmers, and creating supportive policy environments, we can make carbon farming a cornerstone of a more sustainable and equitable food system. Section 11. Conclusion. Cultivating hope through carbon farming. The challenges facing our planet are daunting, but we cannot afford to succumb to despair. Carbon farming offers a beacon of hope, a testament to the power of human ingenuity, and our ability to work in harmony with nature to create a more sustainable and just world. By harnessing the power of the soil, we can transform agriculture from a significant source of greenhouse gases into a powerful tool for combating climate change. 
In doing so, we can not only heal our planet, but also build a more resilient and equitable food system for generations to come. The future of our planet depends on our ability to make peace with the Earth. Carbon farming offers a path forward, a way to cultivate not only food, but also hope for a brighter future.